Hey guys, Shane here. Thanks for stopping by the Crypto Fish YouTube channel. Uh, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe, hit the uh, notification icon for future updates on videos I have coming out. Um, so I got a little announcement today. If you guys have been with me for a while, I said as the channel grows, um, so will Bitcoin Fridays. So as you can see here, I'm at 502 subscribers. So to celebrate that, I guess, from now on, Bitcoin Fridays, I will be giving away $20 in Bitcoin um, every Friday, okay? was 15 so now it's $20 going forward. Uh, so thank you guys for subscribing and um, staying here with me and watching the videos. I really appreciate it, guys. Um, again, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe. Um, the enter to win video for Bitcoin Fridays will be tomorrow and then of course on Friday I'll pick a winner so that's what's hop in I got some uh, news coming about Tron and some updates on my mining rig all right so let's hop right in and check that out All right, so here we are, spreadsheet as usual. Um, if you weren't here yesterday, I stopped mining Electronium now, and I'm mining um, Monero because it's more profitable. Not much. Uh, the CPU mining uh, Electronium was only doing like one to two cents a day, which is really pathetic. So I stopped that, and I'm now I'm mining. Let's pull it up here. I'm using XM rig. And mining Monero now. Probably can't see that too well, but I'm at 207 accepted shares, zero rejected. Last I checked, this is getting me 13 cents a day on the CPU. It's not a lot, but it's better than one to two cents. Um, 1060s right here are mining uh, Ravencoin as usual. 3,986 accepted, only three rejected. So that's going fine. Cards are cool. Um, everything's going good on that rig. So far this week, we've mined 205, 205 Raven coin, uh, 2,266 all time so far. Um, 269 Tron this week, which of course, I'm mining Ethereum, sending it over to uh, Binance and buying Tron. So $12.02 so far this week of Ethereum mined. This number is a little bit off. Uh, it should be about $30.99. I had $10 carry over from last week of the Bitcoin I was mining. Um, so today we got 641 Electronium uh, mined so far. That's with my two phones and no longer with the CPU. So just two phones going forward. Verge, of course, 3,771. Just went over Raven and Tron. We're sitting at 1,041 Tron um, with mining so far. Uh, also, this little graphic I added yesterday, my ROI, this is what I've spent right there on everything. 2950, both rigs, boards, parts to go with it, power supplies, etc. Um, and down here, that number is what I have left to pay it off. So as this number goes up, that number goes down. So, um, so we're at $423, still down from last week, but that's because the uh, markets are down a little bit from last week. So all my coins are down a little bit. Um, mining pool hub. Ethereum, this will cash out at 0 .2, 0 0.02, and then I'll be able to buy some more um, Tron with that. So that should, I would imagine, maybe late tomorrow, early, early on Thursday. Yeah, maybe early Thursday. I should be able to buy some more Tron this week with that. And of course, here's Monero mining with the uh, CPU now. Uh, mining Monero, and I'm converting that to Ethereum, and then I'm sending all that over to buy Tron. Uh, simple mining, nothing new here. Everything's running fine as usual. Let me see if I can pull the console up. Yep. 
So this has been running 87 hours now, 6,176 accepted shares, none rejected. Um, I'm really thinking about getting one more 560 card and just filling this rig out. That'll give me six GPUs on this one rig, and I'll be done with that, and then maybe I'll just start building another rig with that after that. And the NVIDIA GPUs are still just... I mean, sometimes every once in a while you get a good price, but they're, for the most part, they're just too expensive right now. The, uh, these AMD cards, these little 6-gig cards, or not the, the 564-gig cards, they're doing all of them right there at 13.5 mega hash. And two of those I haven't done anything with right out of the box is what they're doing. Of course, I have the overclocks right here. I don't have any BIOS mods on them. So it is what it is. I mean, it's... Not bad little cards for the price. Uh, moving on, we got some Tron news, which makes me happy as usual because I'm holding a lot of Tron right now. Tron announces huge plans to take down Ethereum. Now, how how true that would be going forward, I don't know. I don't think you can take that down, but it's a nice headline. Anyways, uh, the Tron stream is less than two weeks away from its mainnet launch. In that time, Tron will leave its Ethereum based ERC-20 token behind and will become entirely independent. The Tron token will migrate on June 25th after Tron's main net has been thoroughly tested. Basically what this article is saying is um, the uh, smart contracts. Tron is making uh, it easy for people who've got smart, truck, smart contracts on Ethereum to move those over to um, the Tron, you know, testnet, mainnet will be in the future. Uh, for those readers who don't know what the Ethereum BM is, let me explain a little further. The Ethereum virtual machine serves as a runtime environment for smart contracts based on Ethereum. The VM, virtual machine, is completely separate from the main network, and every node running the Ethereum network runs its own EVM implementation. So it seems that Tron, the Tron team, is giving developers the ability to move their dApps currently on Ethereum to the new Tron virtual, mach virtual machine. Sneaky. We so it's pretty cool. Sneaky, I guess. If you want to call it that? I, I, whatever. Tron VM version 0 0.1 will be launched on May 25th, which is 10 days from now. This version will be fully compatible with the Ethereum virtual machine. All Ethereum developers will be able to use and adapt it to migrate seamlessly from Ethereum dApp projects to Tron. We will offer a reward program. Stay tuned. So they're actually going to be giving an incentive for people to pull off of Ethereum and head on over to Tron. Good news. I'm hoping all this you know, bullish news on Tron is going to actually pay off. I would really like to see Tron hit, you know, one, two dollars at least. Um, I'd be, you know, if hit two dollars, I'd be sitting around twenty thousand dollars worth of Tron, which would be really nice. I'm sure a lot of other people out there hold a lot of Tron too, and they'd like to see the same as well. So yeah, Tron is um, making a lot of headlines. There's a lot of talk about it. Um, I guess we'll find out here in a couple weeks how everything's going to go, at least over the next month. So with that, guys, I guess that's it. Uh, I want to thank everyone again who subscribed. Got me over 500 now. I really appreciate it. Um, when I hit 1,000, I will be bumping that price point up again for Bitcoin Friday. So if you could, spread the word. I really appreciate it. And uh, let's let's get to 1,000, guys. So... With that, if you liked the video, hit the like button. If you guys have any questions or comments, just put them down below. I always get back to everyone, or at least I try to. Uh, again, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe and hit the notification icon, okay? So again, tomorrow, be on the lookout for the uh, Enter to Win video for Bitcoin Fridays. All right, guys? With that, I will see you all later. Bye.